welcome back to another video. Today we are at ABC Bricks Brickworks Market. Brick Brickworks, okay, Brickworks ABC. Can you remember the market got ABC? So it's very easy to remember. And we're gonna try out this Western food store called Wow Wow. Where? So it is mainly sourced Western food, and apart from many reviews that the portion is big, the food is good. Even my dad himself said the fish and chips is so big that he couldn't finish the portion. So yeah, we, we ordered some food and we're just waiting for our our order. They have this electronic um, beep thing and this is the stuff that we ordered. Two fish and chips and a chicken chop. Total at $23. There's no plus plus. So yeah, okay. Um, anyway, this store, if we heard from uh, the boss herself, has been around for over 20 years. Which is, wow, that's a very long time and this this name of the shop actually started from when they first opened it in RI Raffles Institution and one of the boys actually gave them this idea of the shop name so I guess this is where they started and how they started so I just can't wait to taste their food now because I'm so hungry so I'll see you guys when the food comes prospects for you guys to know their store is actually closed on every Sunday and Monday so to if you want to try their food, don't come on this today. And do expect very long wait and queue, especially on Saturdays or maybe uh, every day. Every actual. day, like actually, wow, somebody just on get their food and then go, go, go. Like, wow, it's so big. Okay. Sorry, see you later. <laughs> Um, the food has arrived with the chicken chop. Oh, is that not wrong? Yep, chicken chop. Wow, the chicken chop. Very big portion. I love the thick up fries. You can see the coleslaw and then the big bean. Yummy. Yeah, okay. We are now waiting for our fish and chips to come before we can start Okay. Don't have the no, it's like quite fresh kind of smell. But then the sauce, oh my God. just I like, dip a little bit. It's a little bit too salty for my liking. So um, I won't encourage the sauce to be deep so much. Okay. So one thing I feel about this plate, right? The portion is big, ah, uh, great, amazing for the price. My plate a bit too small. <laughs> then I got no place to put all my sides separate, especially. Because they don't give like extra side plates or saucer to put our chili sauce, so everything will have to just be dumped on the plate. Which is something I that's one of my pet peeves. Like I cannot make my food all together. Okay, so yeah, I mean they were thinking well for the cleaner uncles and auntie like, because one less plate to wash for them. But yeah, the portion is really good for now. So let's just try the fish. But the fish is like tough. It's like really like not like dory kind eh. It's like better quality fish eh. Mm, let's try with a bit of the tata. Very fresh, right? Mmm! I think it's worth it. Get the fish. <laughs> Compared to the chicken chop. I'm not sure about chicken cutlet. Maybe next time I'll try. And the, the food itself comes with coleslaw, big beans, and thick cut rice. So, I like it all. Yummy! Let's eat! open an outlet in the east but I don't think they'll call Wow Wow, wow, wow East because right what I noticed is like you know when I tag the location on Instagram they'll put Wow Wow West genuine so this is the actual and the only outlet that with, that has a genuine word inside um, so yeah this is their name card you can see like that, that phrase there there is always you turn in Christ so deep very good I like it. Okay, so now let's just go straight into the rating. Firstly, for food, I'll give it um based on okay, based on just because we only ordered two 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 different dishes, the chicken chop and the fish and chip. I really enjoyed the fish and chip. 
But it's just that the portion was too big, so towards the end I felt a bit too jelak already, like too much fried items, you know. But if other than that, it's good to share between two people if you are not a big eater. And to this chicken chop, like I've said earlier on, it's, the sauce is a bit too salty. But what we have heard from the boss, the lady boss herself, she said every every of the ingredients like it's kind of like handmade, like their sauce they handmade it and maybe today there were some inconsistencies because uh, different workers work on the sauces. And I really enjoyed the mayonnaise. Because it's like I don't know, it's, it's different from the 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 normal kind of mayonnaise or tata sauce. Like there's something unique to it, so I kinda enjoy it. The fries and the coleslaw, you can see I didn't finish it because um, the fish itself was too huge. Um, I'm already filled, <laughs> so I didn't manage to finish those sides. So of course, I'll give it a 7.6 upon 10. Okay. So now moving on to service. Service, the staff here are all really, really very friendly. The moment we step here to take the video, the staff already like, oh, they want to take a picture or what? They just shared many of the things with us. So service are easily give it a 9.5 9. 9. upon 10. And because of service, right? It really makes this place very good. Ambience is a normal hawker centre, so don't expect much because it's just really normal hawker centre. And now dining, dining, in, dining out only allowed in groups of two, so it's a bit sad because you can't really enjoy it with your whole family. <laughs> okay, so ambience is just a typical seven upon ten. And lastly, the pricing. Like I've said, pricing is really worth it. Like my fish and chip, eight dollars with three big slices of fish. And three sides really worth it. Just that uh, one one thing I would like to talk uh, they could improve on is maybe they can have disposable sauces for us to pour our sauce in because the the portion is big, the plate is not very big. There's no space for you to put more condiments. You'll just make all the the, the fried fried items very soggy. So yeah, that could be something they could work on uh, if they don't want to you know give side plates or extra stuff to wash. Okay, so that's it for this video. Oh yeah, I haven't given overall review. Uh, overall review, the points I will give for this place is I'll give uh, eight upon ten. And when I come back, um, if I was in the area, I would because it's, it's like totally different location of where I'm staying. So I hope they open one in this. <laughs> so that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Do like and subscribe, and also comment down below what other you know hawker center kind of unique. Western food I should try out eh, if I have the time to. So see you guys again. Bye bye!